finally, everyone, we reached the end. The last phase, phase five. We've apologized to ourselves. We've made schedules. We are secure in our alone time. We've reflected. And now, if there's another person involved, we must apologize to them. Sincerely. And again, do not force yourself to be in any of these phases. Each phase kind of naturally just comes to you. When you find yourself in that phase, that's when you go about doing what you're doing, okay? Don't force anything because that's gonna send you right back. It's gonna send you back two phases. Every fourth phase sends you back two, okay? So just don't do it. So apologize sincerely to whoever is involved, if there's a party involved, you know? If not, then you, you go, you Gucci. Next video's for you. This step does not apply to you. But if there generally is another person involved to anything, you know, it could be something big, something small. If you feel like you wronged someone in some way, even, even, big point even if they've wronged you you are now the place where you're so secure you've recognized what you've done you've apologized to yourself for what you've done let that person hear your truth let that person hear that you've that you're now acknowledging what it is that you've done wrong and you apologize to them be aware be very aware of the outcome okay cuz everybody's not in the same place as you and that's okay which is why this step is a hard step and this step is one that you do not force i repeat do not force this step okay but once you're here be aware the person might not be so forgiving the person might not want to hear from you the person might want to talk down on you the person man that person might be mean to you that person just might be awful to you but that's okay if you're in phase five you can handle it it's gonna hurt if the person doesn't do it in the nicest way you know doesn't accept your apology whatever but you're giving yourself the chance to be heard and you're giving that person a chance to speak up. Maybe they wanted to say something to you this entire time and they felt like they couldn't, they felt like you wouldn't want to hear, they they don't know what's going on, maybe they're not secure within themselves yet and you now being the bigger person are giving them an opportunity to say something that maybe you need to hear or not say something which makes, which is also something that's deafening. Man, it's crazy to see how far you've gotten by looking at another person that was a part of the situation that is still in a different phase and you don't judge them because you were, you were once there. You can feel for them and hope that they get to where they need to be, but that's not your problem. And you realize, wow, I'm really growing. Silence is deafening. Or maybe, again, they apologize to you and even that, everything that happens has a lesson involved. Everything that happens means something. Everything that happened happened for a reason. And even if that person was so awful to you, maybe by you being as kind as you are, as forgiving as you are, and as apologetic as you are, even if they're awful to you and you walk away, killing them with kindness if you walk away with your heart still intact your heart pure even if it hurts you maybe that is the thing that they needed to get them on track to where you are now and who knows maybe one day you'll hear from them again but don't look forward to that don't look for it just live your life because it might not happen but who knows yeah who knows? i don't know who knows so step two kind of just went over that accept the outcome of what happens with the apology and keep it pushing Live your life, baby. Live your life. Yeah, that's about it. We healthy, we fit, we doing our thing. Sometimes we, we go backwards. But that is okay because if you keep that positive aura with you, nothing can stop you. I promise you, I've never been happier in my life. And I'm still working on it. Um, every day, I'm still working on it. And people tell me all the time, you know, how do I look? How am I so happy? How am I this? How am I that? And that's why I decided to do this video and a couple more things that are to come in the future. So keep a lookout. If you like this video, share it with someone who needs it. Keep it for yourself. Watch it again. You know, write it down. I hope you take these steps. Comment down below where you're at. If you're in a phase, if I helped you, if there's something, if you have any questions, anything, I'm honestly, honestly, genuinely here because I want to spread love and I want you to feel the same way that I feel. I want you to surpass me. I want you, man, I want us all on the same train because there's so much hate in this world and we can bring so much more light into it if we all just open our eyes. It all starts with you. If you like this type of thing, if you need this inspiration because positivity is key to moving forward in the phases, subscribe. 
hit my bell because you know I'm gonna be posting every week I'm also quite humorous so feel free to binge watch the past videos and I'll see you guys I'll see you guys another time you know what I'm saying my social media I'm always active on Instagram so definitely feel free to you know slide over there and see what I got going on you know you feel me eventually hopefully I strive to have an active Twitter with you guys where I can get some questions in and answer those questions but girl I'm giving away too much information right now oh my god let me just relax I'll see you guys next week we peoples, I'm out, we out here. Yeah, 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 get your calendar, get your schedules, write your stuff. Okay, okay, bye. <laughs> I missed again.